Hello everybody, this is Frank from FNL Superstore and I'm doing a long-awaited tablet review and uh, today I'm reviewing one of our newer tablets, the C97 from Zenithink. We've actually been selling Amlogic Tool Core tablets for a little over four months now, but we've been waiting for Zenithink to finally release their versions of the Amlogic tablets. And they did so a little over a month ago and you ask, well, well, why did it take you so long to do a review? Well, I, I wanted to get a product in here that we thought was extremely affordable and performed well. There have been other Amlogic dual core tablets out. We carried Ramos, we carried Onda, but they're a little on the expensive side and they really don't offer any more features than like a Zenithink um, and also an Inel. And uh, Inel is another company that we will be featuring in our store very shortly. We've already started selling the crystals and, and the flames will be in stock soon. So, um, after testing the C97 thoroughly, I figured might as well do a demo show what these puppies can do. The demo unit in the video is running Cyanogen Mod 10, uh, Jelly Bean, which is still in the beta stages for us, but extremely stable. You can follow Christian Troy's thread on Slate Droid for more info on the mod, and also any updates if you choose to buy one already installed with CM10 from us, or if you'd purchased one from somebody else, uh, and you just wish to change from your stock ROM to something a little more glamorous and flashy than Zenithink's official build. Uh, you also get uh, uh, updated G apps, which unfortunately uh, Zenithink is not including with their original build. So that's, uh, I guess, another plus. The, the, I like the way the new apps look. As you can see, I'm running a Halloween-themed live wallpaper. Since Halloween just passed, I've had this demo unit actually ready for a little over a week now, and I'm just now doing the voiceover. But a fair warning that such apps are a battery and resource drain to your tablet, and we honestly don't recommend them for your tablet or phone. If you own anything Android, just uh, you know, don't do it. It just kills your battery. <laughs> for this demo's purposes, though, I wanted to stress the tablet as much as possible to show off its features. Also note that in the beginning of this video, that I'm not using stop editing to shorten the video time, and I'm doing this to show people how fast the tablet gets in and out of your regular everyday apps just so the user can get an idea of the actual speed of the tablet without simulating faster speeds by editing out the downtime in between loading and closing apps, which is uh, something that you used to had you had to do on the single core machines because they just weren't fast enough. You had to delete that extra five or six seconds in between uh, opening and closing apps. Only when the 3D gaming starts do I edit out parts because some of those games are up to two gigs in size and require loading of objects, textures, and of course data. But now let's get to the tablet. Specs of the C97 are, of course, the Amlogic dual core processor running at 1.5 gigahertz or 1.3 gigahertz max, depending on the ROM and the dual core. And it also has a dual core Mali 400 GPU. One gigabyte DDR3 RAM. Uh, eight gigabyte storage is standard pretty much for Zenithink tablets. And that's expandable by 32 gigabyte through the micro SD slot. Ports are very common for uh, China-based tablets, an HDMI port, so you can hook it to your TV. Micro USB port, uh, you could hook uh, you could hook an OTG cable to it and use a keyboard or a mouse or memory or uh, a Bluetooth dongle. It, the Cyanogen mod allows Bluetooth dongles. We wanted to throw that in there. Um, and it also charges. It is 5 volt, so you're going to be able to charge it with any USB, whether it be through a wall USB or a computer. Multi-touch capacitive touchscreen and a crispy, clear, high-resolution IPS screen. What's an IPS screen, do you ask? Well, the same screens that the second-generation iPads use and have a great viewing angles and crisp colors. And that's the best way to explain it in as few words possible. If you want an elaborate explanation, I expect, uh, or I suggest that you Google it. If you look at the whole video, you can see we tested to play pretty much every popular game and app in the Play Store. I could sit here and name them all, but uh, if you just go to the Play Store and then go to apps, and you'll see the 20 most popular. There's no, there's no secret why they're the most popular. Um, I can sit here and talk forever, uh, but the video will show you what this tablet does. If you're looking to see what 3D games it can play, at 14 minutes and 20 seconds it starts the 3D game demo. We, of course, sell these tablets in our store at www.flsuperstore.com, and they are competitively priced to help you avoid going direct to China and avoid uh, a huge headache if you should have to return your pad 
for any reason. Um, if you're in the United States, you just return to us and we replace it or repair it. Uh, it's as simple as that. And the cost uh, to use U.S. mail is cheaper than gas in most cases. Our company actively pursues software modifications and are consistently looking to better our Android products. For instance, with the help of Christian Troy, we were the first company to develop the Signage and Mod 10 for the C97, the C93, the Crystal, the Flame, aka the Fire, Elf 2, and Aurora 2, all Amlogic tablets. We also offer stock repacks and a mainline to the most recent updates. We are the only company in the world that does this, and trust me, I know all of my competitors, and they are always weeks late on providing official ROMs for their tablets, and we are always weeks ahead of releasing custom ROMs for the same tablets. And I'm not just exaggerating here. Just do some research on the Slate Droid forums about our custom ROMs, custom repacks, and you'll see for yourself what our company has to offer in the form of service and support. You aren't going to find that kind of service, that kind of hands-on service, anywhere else on the planet, period. I promise you that. Stay tuned for our reviews of Inal and Logic tablets as we've recently formed a relationship with them, as I had stated earlier, and have started carrying their Crystal and Flame models. We wanted to get them both together and do a review. The Flame has been delayed a little bit because of a super high IPS screen, the same exact screens that the Kindle Fire HD uses, and they will be a direct competitor to the to Kindle Fire, I would think. They're about $30 less. Uh, retail, maybe a, li maybe a little less than that uh, going more towards Christmas. If you like our reviews and products, please subscribe to our channel here on YouTube, follow us on Twitter, and like us on Facebook. All of the links to our socials, website, and forums we represent are below in the comment box. Thanks for watching.